Today I'm going to show you guys how to get these really, really cute and easy dream catcher and feather nails. So here I'm just painting a second coat of white onto my pinky and I'm also going to be painting my pointer finger white as well. Then I'm painting a second coat of Essie, Where's My Chauffeur, onto my ring finger. And for my middle finger, I'm using a color called Circus Peanuts. It's like a bright coral orange color, and this is by Finger Paints. And lastly, for the thumb, I'm using a glittery silver color, and this is Beyond Cozy by Essie. So to start the feather dreamcatcher design, I'm just going to draw a rounded shape by my cuticle and that's going to be the first line that we're going to draw. So just make a curved shape and come in from both sides. I'm using a black striper brush. I'm just fixing and filling in a little spot where I thought it didn't look full enough. And then I'm going to take that same striper brush and create another little half moon shape and I'm just going to start drawing lines. It doesn't have to be perfect. Um, any little like sideways lines will look good. Then again I'm just going in and I'm just going to draw some lines. I'm just going to go down, um, draw down with a striper brush. So just create some lines. Again, it doesn't have to be absolutely perfect. And then in between those lines, I'm just drawing in a few sideways lines to fill it in. Okay, now we're going to draw in the little feathers. So I'm just going to draw four lines down from that half moon shape. So just draw one, and then I drew the second one, and then just draw down another line. Next we're going to draw the little feathers on the bottom of the line, so just create some lines. I'm just drawing and make them look a little bit fluffy. Um, just keep drawing some lines, and it's okay if a pro the product on the brush runs out because it makes it look a little bit more feathery anyways. And I'm just drawing again, making some feathers, so this is going to be the bottom of the dream catcher. Then just to spice it up and give it some color, I'm going to take that coral color that I painted on my middle finger and just dot it on with a dotting tool. Then I'm taking white on a smaller dotting tool and I'm just dotting on some white into the little dream catcher net section. Just again to give it some color and just give it a fun pattern and it really makes it look like a dream catcher. Then I took some more white on the dotting tool and I'm just dotting it right above the feathers. Next I wanted to create the feather on my pointer finger so I just drew a line across my nail, slightly curved, and then I'm just going to draw some lines on each side to create that feather look. So just keep drawing, again it doesn't have to have a lot of product on the brush, you could just keep drawing and it makes it look a little bit more feathery. And I'm just drawing again, keep drawing on some feathers on both sides and it'll really start to come together. Then I'm just going to do the same exact thing I did on my other nail, only on my middle finger. Just drawing on the two curve shaped lines to create the net part of the dream catcher. Draw on some lines right above that you just drew make some little triangular shapes and then you can just fill it in wherever you feel like you want to to just create that net design. So just draw random lines. I'm just doing little triangles and it makes it look more like a net. Then I'm just doing the same thing I did before, just creating little feathers with my black striper brush. You can go ahead and dot on any color you want. I just liked using the Essie Where's My Chauffeur because it was like the two opposite nail colors that I did. Um, and then I'm just dotting on the white right above the feathers. 
Okay guys, that is the completed Dreamcatcher nail art. I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know if you did down in the comments. Thanks guys!